As Japan marks one year since a devastating earthquake and tsunami killed over 19,000 people, uh, devastating an entire nation. Also triggered the worst nuclear crisis in a quarter century after the cooling systems at the Japanese Fukushima plant. Japanese officials are planning to pump out contaminated water from the quake hit reactors at the Fukushima nuclear plant. Authorities hope the measure will help efforts to restore the facility's cooling systems. It comes after radiation was detected in groundwater near the plant for the first time. The levels were 10,000 times higher the legal limit. Authorities say they don't plan to expand the 20-kilometer evacuation zone. If there is a face to the zone. Fukushima disaster, Amiko Numaochi, a high school teacher of 18 years, believes she could be it. Her hair has started falling out. Her once healthy teeth have as well, leaving her dentist dumbfounded. And then there are the unusual rashes She's running along her sides. She's rusty and crewless, but still afloat. A fishing boat that survived the tsunami a year ago has been found. She was spotted from the air. In the earthquake and tsunami, waves of unimaginably destructive power pounded the Japanese coast. Since then, the 50-meter ship has traveled some 4,500 miles from Japan to here, close to Haida Gwaii. Formerly known right as the now, Queen Charlotte. At 11 Island. for you, new information on that horrific attack by the MacArthur Causeway. Police were forced to open fire on a naked man who refused to stop chewing the face off of another man. Antonio, a lot of new information coming in in the last hour. This is a story that gained international attention because of how wild it was. A man biting off the face of a homeless man, literally disfiguring him. Everyone from the very beginning said that had to be on something. Well, we now know he was on something, marijuana. And that is the big surprise here. From the very beginning, police officers and medical experts had theorized that was perhaps on something called bath salts, a drug that... Yeah. 